Hey guys, as you can see, it's uh, cold and um, windy and yeah. Hey guys, um, it's a cold and windy day today. As you can see in the background, it's raining, well needed. So I decided to just do some small things on my Land Rover. One of the things I need to tackle is the wear on the mass flow sensors cabling. I'll show you what it looks like now. It's basically, it folds quite, the cable folds and the cable wears out and creates a short. Um, it's a common problem on the Pumas. Um, I, we see quite a few of them as that issue, so I'll quickly show you guys what it looks like. Hey guys, so you've got your MAF sensor here, MAS airflow, and then as you can see on the wiring side, there's some wear there, and that causes it to short eventually. So I'm going to take this off or put it here on the side of the bonnet and use some wonder fix to, to fix that. So maybe just pop around on your defenders. Have a look, see if your wiring is in good nick. You don't want to stand next to the road because, or go into limp mode because of a error code. So, so let's tackle the issue. Okay, guys, this just pops off quite easily, and then you pull it. I'm gonna just work on it here. I'll put some cardboard underneath it, but the idea is to to sort out this bend that you see in the wire. So the product we will be using is Wonder Fix um, Car. Um, make sure you get the, the color black, and then you need to mix it one part of this tube and two parts of that tube. I'm just going to run it around the top there. Make sure all the wires stays in a good place and doesn't come loose. Okay, guys, I don't really have anything to mix it with nicely, but I've got two of those sticks, and what I'll do is I will just mix one part of that and about open that up one two parts of, of that I need to let it sit for according to the manual for three minutes at 23 degrees so it's a bit colder so I'm gonna let it sit for about five minutes once it's set I'll put it on the plug so just checking the time now okay 10, 10 to 2 so I'm going to wait a few minutes and take it from there. I'm going to pause now. If you look at the plug, the, some of the wires are already open and the yellow wire is starting to go open. And I mean, this is stuff you never really loosen. It is sitting at a funny position, so maybe the bonnet is pushing down on the cable, causing it to tear. Um, I'm going to, once this is has set, I'll just wipe that. Once that is set, I'll put it on, make sure it's nice and straight and gets quite hard. This is basically just to prevent mass flow sensor error codes um, should a wire um, eventually short out or, or come loose. So that's about five minutes. So what I'm going to do is, you can see this is already sticky. So I'm going to do that on this side. Yeah, the stuff is like crazy sticky. Okay, let's try hoping not to, but I'm going to use my fingers to... Yo. Okay, so you guys get the idea. Um, this will harden and keep the wires there. Don't think I need more than that, but that's at least a good start. Let's see if you guys can see it. You can see the yellow wire there. I'll close that up now. The light does help a bit. There you go. That should um, hold it quite nicely. And then once it's dry, I will just plug it back in. It's not fully hardened yet, but I'm gonna keep the bonnet open. Just plug it in then it can at least dry in the direction you know we want it to dry so knowing the cables are going to run like that and when it dries I'll push that this wire back into the cable tie there making sure it stays nice. 